Hello guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. In case you're new here, my name is Trent Girl Karibu Sana and thank you so much for clicking this video. For the returning subscribers, Asante Nisana. The court has given the DCA orders to exhume the body of Jeff Mwadi today on Tuesday 27th March 2023 after which fresh post-mortem will be carried out. Jeff died under unclear circumstances on February 22nd in DJ Fatso's house after allegedly jumping from the apartment's 10th floor. It was later revealed that Jeff was actually killed in the DJ's house before his body was thrown from the apartment's rooftop. Further investigations revealed that at least five people were involved in Jeff Mwadi's murder after DNA was carried on the murder weapon. Inspector of Police Jafet Kome assured Kenyans that justice for Jeff will be given after the DCA will carry out their investigations into the case. Exhuming the body will definitely reveal what really happened to Jeff Mwadi on that fateful day. Jeff Mwadi's body allegedly fell to the ground floor of Fatso's apartment and there were speculations that he may have been sodomized before being killed and thrown to the ground floor. While well, the family of Jeff Mwadi is seeking justice and answers after his death in the house of DJ Fatso, a report by Noro TV indicated that on the day the young man died, he had spent the day with the DJ who had contracted him for some interior decor in his shop. An excited Mwadi was excited to work for the musician and after spending the day together at Kiambu Road, they then went to have fun at various entertainment joints, the last one being Quiver, which they left at 3 a.m. CCTV footage being reviewed by the police showed that Fatso, Mwadi and three ladies went into his apartment located along the car road before things went south. This is what Jeff Mwadi's uncle said. At around 4 a.m., Fatso and the three ladies left the house and they left Jeff in the house with two other men. Nobody knows what happened in that house as the two men also left the house and went down to the parking and looked over. Fatso's cousin was also seen making a call and then Jeff fell from the 10th floor. Now that the DCI have decided to go ahead and exhume the body of Jeff Mwadi, we hope that finally justice will be served. Well guys, what are your thoughts about this? What do you think really happened to Jeff Mwadi? Share what you think in the comment section down below. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching my video. I've been your host Trent Skull. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more hot trending topics. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.